back to another video with the Nature Squad. My name is Hudson. This is my second solo video. And today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to make hummingbird feeder food, sort of. So, have you ever seen those tiny little hummingbirds? You might not. Um, but you probably know what they are. They're these tiny little birds that always, their, their wings beat really, really fast. And they're always drinking nectar from the flowers. And they have really pretty colors. And they're just fun to watch and watch them do their thing but they're very skittish and they really don't like people that much but they will like you if you do what we're about to do in this video so one day my sister came in and she had found a hummingbird feeder in like a box it has unopened fully packaged everything had instructions we put the special sugar water thing in my aunt and my mom helped her with it and our patio has so many hummingbirds, it's crazy. And that also helps me a lot as well because I have plants out there and they're going to pollinate my plants, which is just going to be great. Um, so uh, today I'm going to be just teaching you guys how to make the food. Um, I do not know how to make a feeder. Uh, if any of you guys know how to do that, comment down below. We want to know. Um, but I'm going to be teaching you guys how to make the um, hummingbird uh, nectar sort of sugar water because they're not there anymore. But there was about like six or seven hummingbirds outside and there's only four slots um, on the hummingbird feeder. And um, it's crazy. So if you guys want to have a bunch of hummingbirds in your uh, patio, this video is for you. So here's the hummingbird feeder. There, there was one just trying to drink from it. It took about a week for them to get the whole thing. It just filled to the brim. They're, they're literally, oh, you guys can't see it, but they're, they're really watching me as I do this. So you're probably wondering, what weird colors? Why is this red? Well, the reason why it's red is hummingbirds drink from flowers. They drink the nectar from flowers, and um, red attracts them. Now, guys, there was a major issue a while ago. Do not dye your hummingbird food with red dye, any dye. It will kill them. There was a big thing that was going on where people were red dyeing their hummingbird feeder food. And oh lord, there's one right here. There's one right here. Oh my gosh, they're getting braver and braver. I don't know if you guys saw that. They're, it's like flying above me. It is not happy I'm here. It wants its food. It's really pretty as well. It had a big, bright stomach. Um, so don't red dye, don't dye your food. Just get a colorful feeder. And the key is to have one part sugar, four parts water. And I'm going to show... Oh my gosh, he's attacking me now. He just attacked my iPad. Oh my gosh, they're getting braver. And guys, it's not attacking, it's just flying at me. Look at him, he's right there. I thought he was scared of me. Oh my gosh, there's two of them. Oh my gosh, no way. Like, I am right in front of him. Like, this is my hand with the feeder. The oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, they are getting brave. Okay, I'm so sorry, guys. This is probably having a really weird reaction, but this is a little crazy. They've never been like this. They're really pretty birds as well. Look at that one. It's got, like, a pink color. Anywho, they're not attacking me. I think they're just flying at me, trying to get me out of the place. But you guys see their colors. Look how pretty they are. Why wouldn't you want that in your yard? Look, they're fighting. There's, like, a bunch of them fighting for the food. So, gotta go, guys. Gotta go. So, um, it's going to be one part sugar, four parts water, and I'm going to show you guys how to do that in a second. Alrighty guys, so um, we already started making the sugar water, but like I said before, you want to get something like this big, you want to get a scoop of sugar, probably like to the rim of this, dump it, and then put, um, so one part, so just one of these of sugar, and four of these of water. And now what you're going to want to do is you're going to heat it up on the stove. Here, let me show you. You're just going to go to the stove, heat it up just so that it can melt in and soak in and everything, like the sugar, so that it can melt into the water. And then you want to stir it up. All right, I'll see you guys when it's ready. Alrighty, guys, so um, once you're done, all you need to do really to heat it up is you want to heat it up and mix it till like the sugar granules aren't there anymore. They're just mixing with the water. It'll look like this yellowy sort of thing. See, the hummingbirds drink this whole thing. If you live in an area where the hummingbirds are common, dude, they are going to go crazy. They will love you slash battle you because they just think that if you're near their food, you're a threat. But you guys can't see this, but they're all, they're flying everywhere looking for more food. So um, you just let it cool for a bit. A good idea is just to take it outside when it's like a little cooler outside. 
And once it cools down, you can fill it up. So you guys, you guys, once you've let it cool for about 20 minutes, it should be ready. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna unscrew your uh, feeder. Now it doesn't have to be this feeder, whatever feeder you're using. And you're gonna pour the um, sugar water into the cup or whatever the holder, like the jug part. And then you're gonna get the base and then you're just going to flip it over and then you're going to twist it on and you're going to make sure it's secure voila then you simply just wash it off so that there's nothing on the outside that will stick to it and then it's ready to go you guys probably can barely see this but and you're just going to put it outside. Now, it does not have to be at any certain time. And I'll show you guys the hummingbirds feeding off of it tomorrow. Guys, our sugar water was a success. Um, there were hummingbirds here a second ago. Um, we have to just wait for them to come back so I can show you guys. But I'm not lying. They do drink from this stuff and they love it. We just got to wait so I can show you guys. Um, they let they go crazy for it. Oh, did you guys see that one? I don't think you guys saw that one, but there's a few flying around. Oh, there's one right there. See, guys, they love this stuff. Sorry the footage isn't the greatest right now. I'm going to see if I can get a little closer without spooking him. As you guys can see, there is a hemming hummingbird right there. There's a few of them that looks like they're trying to um, get territorial. Now there's three of them. But as you guys can see, sugar water, they go crazy for it, and it was a success. A success. Um, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Ooh, ooh, wait, 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 wait. I don't know if you guys saw this. There's one with a pink head. Uh, I think he flew away. Anywho, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell whenever you want to be notified about a new video that we made. There's the pink headed one. And uh, yeah, Nature Squad out.